guys, welcome back to Marvel Contester Champions, and uh, today we're going to be looking at the Catalyst Arena update. Uh, also at the end of the video I'll be doing my own update, just to kind of let you know what is happening content wise, because I haven't been making any. Anything new, anything, apart from the Deadpool week, which I'll get onto after I finish talking about this, because this is what I want to talk about. So, Catalyst Arena update. Obviously from the start point, Kabam have given something to us. Thank you. Uh, teleportation crystal and a uh, tier 4 class catalyst fragment crystal so I will be opening them at the end of the video and uh, from the offset uh, five star champions can now be found in Kang and Thanos team yada 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 future catalyst arenas whilst more challenging battles are ahead yada 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 uh, in addition there will be special five star only class catalyst arena Sunday take it 24 hours yada yada right so what does this mean for the game well, in a nutshell, it means that we're going to create more segregation in in and around where people uh, choose their arenas that they're going to do. So, um, it does say 24 hours for the five star one, but does that mean that uh, this is going to be shipped out? Now, the, the clue is when they, they put uh, battles ahead. Um, so, I'm... Ugh. I don't know. I can't really kind of like comment on if in future that um, all catalyst arenas are going to be 24 hours in runtime, um, or you know, in for the basic you're going to get 24 hours uh, to to do it. Um, it may mean a completely new thing for a Sunday. So obviously, as you know, we get cornucopia every Sunday. Does that mean? that uh, a catalyst arena, uh, w sorry, class catalyst arena will be every Sunday. Will this be an ongoing thing? Uh, which would be quite interesting, but it would be quite good in any case because it allows the players, the more elite players, to then go for this as opposed to maybe doing uh, the other, uh, the normal class catalyst crystal arena. That would be really good. We need a lot of segregation. Uh, we need to um, be able to go to different things and feel that we have a chance because there's going to be some people that would like a chance at getting a, a class catalyst um, for the per, a tier four class catalyst even to in in order to get uh, that first rank five and that's the problem that we've got at the moment. There's not. There's not enough chance for certain players to get... Yes, you have to earn it. Yes, I understand that. Some people will be going, Oh, well, you shouldn't just give it on a plate. No, you have to earn things. Correct. However, uh, the way that Kabam go about things at the moment is it's it's very difficult. We create this very elitist, hierarchical um, kind of community where uh, the the same thing with society nowadays. The, the rich are very rich and the poor are very poor. So it's kind of then putting together, well, that's that's what Kabam don't do very well, and that's create a community. It's not a very kind of social community and, and like a socialist uh, and very kind of liberal community. It's um, a segregated um, uh, them and us type type thing. Um, I don't put myself in either camp. I'm still kind of like, a, like I'd say right down the center, mid, mid kind of table player uh, you know I'm not the best of the best uh, and I'm not certainly the worst of the worst so we have to feel that we can in in future maybe and hopefully this would like I said separate out um, the people and their agendas so their agenda would be instead of because that's another problem I will do that in a later video about uh, alliance agendas and if you're going for a top alliance the chances are the only reason that you're going to go for the top alliance and stay in the top alliance is because you get a class catalyst. People, uh, yeah, class catalyst, uh, tier four class catalyst. Your agendas are very uh, poisonous to a loyalty to an alliance, and um, that that is not that's not cool. That's not cool in any kind of way. Um, it, you, people lose respect for other people because their agendas get in the way of a community as a, uh, a loyal. Um, alliance working together, uh, friends become enemies. It's ridiculous. The positives are that uh, you can earn more with regards to points. So, um, if five star champions are added, in, I've got a, a team of three. Uh, they're not kind of synergied in any kind of way, but uh, the chances are that those those um, players, players, those characters even. So the positives out of this is yes, more points. Points mean prizes. 
and you know if you're if you're earning you know 20 plus k from your uh, tier uh, your your five star team even then that's that's positive to kind of grind more points out uh, and can be an added benefit obviously it still will be the downside is that 1000 gold that it uh, costs you to then put a team in so um, if you've got a lot of gold then it's great if you don't have a lot of gold then it's going to be uh, very detrimental to your your playing which is you know it's still a downside that you have to pay 10,000 battle chips in order to go into uh, that arena but that's the deterrent for uh, deterrent even deterrent deterrent um, for you entering in that it's meant to be set up for again um, uh, elitist players to go in so there's going to be players that will go and watching this video and you might go well you know I'd like to really kind of enter into that yeah I know I understand that um, but that's that's the way the game game set out. The best of the best go in for it, and um, you're expected if you can't get into it to grind your way through to get that. And I'm not saying that that you know that should change. Um, I would like um, this to be this change and this update even to be one that, like I said, segregates out and separates out. Sorry, the um, uh, the different type of players. So. More, more different players can find that they can enter into this arena, um, work their way up, and and you know get to that top rank, finishing that top rank, and then when it comes to your more elitist players, you're going into the five star one, the 24 hour one, because it's better for you. Um, the chances of you getting a, a three tier four class catalyst are better for you as a more of elite player. And more obtainable for you than it would be for a player that's grinding out to get to that point so positives separate out um, people and their agendas and downsides could be we have a bigger split between our more elitist players and uh, say the lower players um, if you have no idea what I'm talking about I'm basically talking about people that have higher ratings and can get uh, rank fives more easier than people that say want rank fours or people between rank fours trying to get to rank fives um, It's kind of like a, a hierarchical system so to speak the same way with your the your government uh, Looks after rich people and the way that they look after poor people. That's what I'm trying to kind of get at Anyway, I know you're sick of me rabbiting on so uh, let's go and open up these two crystals so here's the tier 4 one and uh, I'm just going to pop it in any case because there's no point spinning it out. Uh, just some cosmics, uh, nothing really to write home about, 720, no sweat. Let's look, open up the teleportation one. Okay, so here's the teleportation one and I'm just gonna I'm just going to spin it out to the end. Um, I do have to go through and talk about um, the... Uh, what what's happening because I haven't done 2k stuff yet um, because I've been taking a break effectively I've just been having a, a little breather from making content uh, because I need to tell everybody like how how you know people can moan about like edit time and stuff but you know sometimes you just need to chill out from the um, from the game um, not that I get to play it very much uh, life eh I doubt we're going to get anything good. This is Kabam's free crystal in any case, and that's just how it rolls. No, of course. Uh, nothing really important there. Um, I've made a decision about teleportation crystals. I did say that I would potentially open them uh, with the 6,000 units I've got, but I have made a decision in that. I'm going to wait for the next mutant to go in, so it would be Nightcrawler and another mutant. So, oof, I'm hoping Beast is released next week and we, I don't get a whack-ass... Um, stupid mutant being put in. Um, if it's if it's Beast and Nightcrawler, great, I'll do that. If it's um, Gambit, yes, I will. Uh, I don't know. I I've got to wait till next week just to kind of see what's happening with regards to the release of the mutant crystals. Hopefully, it's two decent characters together, and I can pull something great. That would be amazing. Anyway, quickly just to say. Um, I haven't said thank you for hitting 2k so thank you very much for getting me to 2k I need to do competition videos but like I said I am taking a little bit of time off because um, I go to work at 8 a.m. I then come home at um, 5 o'clock cook and then it's uh, make content and I make content to midnight at night and this has been on repeat for about two to three months uh, I'm knackered I'm absolutely knackered and then at weekends 
rush out content, do housework, do gardening. I'm knackered. So um, I'm taking this week off and um, I start recording content back on Monday. There will be a 2K competition, a 2K crystal opening, and uh, just a random crystal opening on Monday. And uh, yeah, I need to retool my content. I'm a bit disappointed with um, uh, the Deadpool week, uh, largely because I put too much effort into it. Some videos were great, some videos were shit, I'm not gonna lie, be brutally honest, uh, br brutally transparent with you as well. And um, I'd say the crystal opening and the trailer and you know, but the, the Deadpool reviews and the brief history, yeah, fantastic, I really enjoyed making those um, and it took a long time. But I will probably not do a theme week ever again and I'll just focus my content on several different things but I will be working my ass off for the next two months to deliver great content um, but I just need to kind of then decide what I'm doing. Probably Pokemon Go, stay, still Marvel Contest of Champions, uh, more World of Tanks, more World of Warships. Um, but uh, yeah, that's the kind of uh, thing. But I'll explain more in a future video. Um, anyway, let me know what you got in the teleportation crystals. Did you get lucky and get a four star? Let me know. Uh, it'd be great to hear from you. And as always, catch me on Twitter. I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, Twitter. Facebook, whatever. Thanks very much for watching. Thank you very much for 2,000 subscribers. And as always, I shall catch you on the flip side. Bye bye. Hi guys, Rich the Man here, and I'm just falling out of a tree. Uh, thank you for watching that video. And remember to like, subscribe, and catch one of my live streams. Anyway, see you later. Bye. Ah, ah, ah. Someone caught an ambulance, for God's sake!